All right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. All right, so here he is, one of the better offensive takedown guys we have in the UFC DC. And if anyone is well equipped to speak to this, it is you. The opponent knows what's coming. At least to this point in the UFC, no one's been able to stop. Him. He just has to keep him away. Because the moment this guy gets close enough to either grab a leg or make body contact, right. now you're in trouble. He has a knowledge and an understanding of position from a lifetime of just all grappling, judo, wrestling, uh, Sambo, he does it all, and he has just so many ways to get you to the floor. This guy once told me that if he can get your leg, he's going to finish. Right. Because he's going to give you so many things to think about, you will not be able to process and keep up with him, and eventually you're on the mat. It's unbelievable to watch him apply that knowledge to the mixed martial arts fight. And as the wrestlers say, this is not a guy you want anywhere near your bracket. No, you don't want him in the bracket. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special, and tonight, He's gonna look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now! This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 141 pounds. Fighting out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Bazooka. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, commit to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out for The fighters touch gloves. You ready? You ready? All right, so lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Nice straight punch. with these beautiful leg kicks. Lance with the right hand. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Keep that 
blocks the shot. Big ball punch land. Now it gets back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch from the punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's leading the dance. Look at him drive his shin into the opponent's body with that body kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Punches blocked. Both fighters here continuing to try to get a more dominant position in the clinch, getting fatigued in the process, I would think. It's very taxing to be chest to chest, a position we call 50-50 because nobody has the advantage. Who's gonna be the one to find that one little area that they can expose to give them the slightest advantage? Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Ooh, what a punch. Just missed with the left there. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, big kick lands flush. Misses with that punch. Slips. Big leg kick land. Good punch land. It's very tricky when he throws that body. He's starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, man. That, you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. And he lands the knee to the body now. Real quick leg kick. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, huge block! Hip over when he throws that kick. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Game of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job fighting the range to land those punches. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Twenty seconds left. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Nice kick. Round two is next. DC second round is getting Whoa. underway. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always going to be. We can have two very talented fighters. Sometimes it's very even. That's what we saw in round number one. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. 
right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Slips. My goodness. Good night if that landed. Big kick lands. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move. Right, yeah. beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. And he continues to work the body here. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Oh! Head kick! He's going after the head. Over and over, he lands a big body kick. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Punch over the top. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. And they separate. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Body kick now by Lee. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. All right, single collar tie now. He's in close, so instead of punching, he's landing with nasty, vicious elbows. Look at him flip his hip into that kick. Nice counter shot there. Beautiful body kick. That was lightning fast, that right hand. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice leg kick land. Lands a punch. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. He changes the angle, finds the right spot. Oh, and he gets the takedown there. Too easy, Chief. Too easy. He has impeccable timing on these takedown attempts. Keeping busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style, Block. he gets denied. Block! Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big boxing land. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that one. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and largely has gotten it done with his striking time. He got it done with his strike. He fought well behind the jab, but it was the significant strikes that really did make an impact on the judges' fight. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Twenty seconds left to go in round two. Beautiful strike. Oh, head kick. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the so far. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks 
to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which core sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the stick. This is what happens. Very skilled, very interesting match fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it on the next Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, He's also keeping very busy. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Right hand on point. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing, Muscle. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Oh, nice jab. Beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. What a body And hit. both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing it. He doesn't have any tell when he's gonna throw a knee. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. Massive head kick. That was a strong to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Real sneaky body kick. Just a slip there. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Changes his stance. Nice punch by Lee. Take more of these leg kicks. You will not be able to be very active on your feet. Switch, he lands to the body. Nice kick to the body. Watch the shot. More than one. More than one. What a tricky head kick. And he landed the right hand there. center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Oh, big. Oh, over to the top. This fight's going to be over this year. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He did stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent. Thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Nice strike. Oh, and he continues to pour. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad.
strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Big kick lands. Oh, nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but oh, defensively oh, oh. as well. Very good read there. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Nice loose punch. Vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking these, you man. You gotta check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. You get you, get you, get you. Head kick. And strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Keep your hands up for me. Come on now. Let's go. Let's Just missing on the high kick there. Liver kick. Huge knee lands from in close. Right on the elbow by the knee lands. Big kick lands. Well, with that right hand, it's no good. What a punch. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Just out of range with that right hook. Just misses with the kick. Hook attempt now blocked, though, by Lee. Oh, man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Right idea, wrong execution. No good on the left punch count. Oh, big punch land. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Big body kick. Connects with a right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Nice one, two there. Well placed kick there by Lee. Right hand upstairs. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. All right, so a seminal blow earlier in the round. It wasn't a knockdown, but it was certainly a stunner that caught his attention. Oh, I mean, he got hurt bad. To see him still standing, that just goes to the toughness that he has to be still standing after taking such a damaging shot. Oh, and he 
tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Nice punch, Lance. He lands the head kick. How about that shin? Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Way to hide that leg kick. Another shot lands upstairs. A single collar tie. Offensive fight. Nice job to block the shot there. He is going a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. A powerful leg kick lands. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Those are sounds for the end of round four. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, next round is underway. These guys still look pretty fresh to me. We know cardio is king in MMA, and these guys have it for days. They have cardio for days. You saw the work rate of the previous round. Let's see if it continues as we start the next round. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Big leg kick land. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. And you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that area. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. Watch the ability to land anywhere. Look at the force behind that leg. Head kick lands. That right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Nice punch here. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Leg kick. Just out of range with that strike. Shot to the body now blocked by Lee. And they set. Oh! Oh! oh what a shot to the body. He's trying to keep him a poker face, but he's hurt very, very bad. Oh, that's a nice strike. There's no tell on that leg kick. Throws the right hand there. Oh, knee strike right to the body. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more stops. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Nice punch lands over the top. Back and forth we go. Nice body kick oh. right under the elbow. Oh, he might be out. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Posturing up now. 
And now the damage is about to start. 90 seconds remain in the fight. Lee's got the full mount. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, that kick is good by Lee. Beautiful execution with the knee strike there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What you follow up a beautiful strike like that speed with? You see very short. Nice body. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. All right, throws a straight punch and lands. So that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes. He's throwing it over and over again. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Let's go. Set the pace. 15 seconds. Nice. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. What a fight. All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, Jim. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. The official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50 45. Playing the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! did not get the finish that he certainly prioritized when we sat down with him in our fighter meeting, but a win is a win. He gets it done by unanimous decision. And he said he wanted a finish, but sometimes your opponent's not willing to play the game. In those instances, all you can do is control what you can control, and that's fight for the best of your